So we can start. Mm -hmm. Yeah, sure. Okay. Mr. Eugene Kaspersky, uh, could you please tell us uh, what you what do you love in life? <laughs> um, that's a good question, and there are many things which are uh, I love in my life. Uh, uh, well, plus to my family. Uh, so the uh, uh, things I love is uh, my uh, business, my work, what I do, because I, uh, it's my life uh, and I live in this cyber security world. Uh, I like to uh, travel when I have the time. I uh, like to explore the world and I go in the many uh, beautiful places. It's most about the natural beauties, the volcanoes, mountains, uh, the uh, colored lakes, uh, some very nice, very beautiful places. And I very like to have, a, uh, to have people all together to run these conferences uh, and to, to see that they are happy people, uh, there is some place which is paradise, uh, where they are talking to each other, they exchange their ideas, they present the research. Uh, so actually I think this, this is their major things which uh, makes my life. I mean, you are not a common person, so you have built one of the largest company in the world uh, in the field of cyber security, okay? okay? And it seems to me that uh, your staff and your employees really love you and consider you inspirational. How, how can it, how can it how can is it possible? I mean, you are still an employer. I mean, you are a, you are the big boss. How come that they love you so much? Uh, well, uh, uh, to be honest, I don't know how much they love me <laughs> <laughs> because they don't tell me about that. <laughs> they consider uh, but you inspirational. Yeah. Uh, I think that uh, we have a special uh, the, the spirit in the company. Uh, the corporate culture, uh, which is uh, made not only by me, but uh, the other uh, company founders and people which are working in the company for many years. Uh, so I was looking for the uh, people which are open, friendly, uh, smart. Uh, it's not only about business, uh, it's uh, about the life which are living together. We spend so much time in business, in the work. So, uh, to have the right people there, you just make your work comfortable. And uh, in the very beginning, I had this, uh, I explained that to uh, my team in such a way that we have to build such an environment uh, when people, they are not rush to get back home. And then in the morning, they rush back to the office. Okay. So, this, I think that we made it and uh, there are many people I know that many people, they like to work in the company and uh, uh, people don't change the world, the, 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 the company. So there are many people, they work for, well, the people which started long ago, most of them, they're still with us. So the people working for 10 years, 15 years, 20 years in the company from the very beginning. Um, and they like it. Yes, but there is something that uh, belongs to you. So if I, if I asked you three adjectives to define who you are, which kind of words will you, would you use? Three adjectives for you. I don't know. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Uh, uh, um, let, let me think. Success in things which I do. Doesn't matter. Yeah, okay. Doesn't yeah. So, 
I, I know. I know the answer. Uh, so three things. Uh, thank you for the question. It was not easy uh, to uh, understand that because it's the first time I'm asked about this. So I think that the uh, first thing is uh, to have success in the things which I'm doing. Uh, second, to have the friendly environment. It's not only friendly to me, but also to other people which are together with me. Uh, and third, to have fun. So this that. is the, your recipe for success? Uh, I don't think that uh, my case can be adapted to other people, but people are different. Uh, I don't guarantee 100% if this, uh, um, if this uh, combination can be done in uh, different places and different okay. businesses. Uh, but in my case it works. Perfect. Last question, last personal question. Uh, could you tell us uh, something more about uh, uh, your family and your studies? Uh, family... I have... <laughs> the family yeah. in which you grew up. Uh, your father, your ah, mother... Ah, so the family, yes. Yeah, your yeah. father, your mother. Oh, okay. Uh, how important were they yes, of course, in yes. developing your yeah, personality? Yeah. Because, yeah. in fact, you have a magnetic personality and you had... The, the, the capacity to build a very big industry based on uh, technology. I mean, so th there's something in your Definitely, life. Definitely, yes. Yeah. So the, uh, uh, I was born in uh, 1965, so 52 years ago. Uh, and uh, I was born in the Soviet Union uh, in a family of an engineer. And uh, my mom, she was, my father was engineer. Uh, and uh, my mom, she was working in a local archive. Uh, and uh, it, uh, I was born in Novorossiysk, it's a soft part of Russia, uh, of Soviet Union. Uh, and then the family moved to uh, Moscow region. Uh, and uh, I think that uh, the, uh, my success, I think it's based mostly on the things that my mother did. Uh, she. She did the, her best to recognize what I like. So she tried me in a different areas and she found that I love mathematics and uh, the physics. And she started to feed me with uh, extra information, with special kids' books about mathematics. Uh, she was try pushing me to have uh, more exercises in mathematics and physics. So uh, I was reading the... Uh, popular scientists' uh, newspapers, uh, magazines. Uh, so I was like uh, moving to the mathematics and uh, then I had, uh, I was winning on the kids on the school. Uh, we called them Olympic Games on Mathematics. So there was uh, kids from different schools all together. And I came to their, uh, as a result, I came to their, well, their mathematical college. So that was the very beginning. So actually, uh, they were, my success was, uh, partly, or mostly made uh, by my family, my mother. So, thank you. Uh, I would like to, to go more in details of uh, the cyber mm -hmm. security field and of your company. Yeah, sure. So, the, the first big question is, what is your vision of the future? Very simple. Yeah, uh, I think that, uh, speaking about the future, uh, I think that uh, in terms of cyber security, uh, there are systems which we use, uh, which will be literally everywhere. Uh, I think that uh, everything will be cyber. Uh, and well, even now there are so many f things about us, they are completely cyber or partly cyber. Uh, if you look around, we'll see there, for example, the fire alarm system, uh, there is a fire, uh, so the uh, fire alarm, the air condition, and uh, ventilation. Uh, I'm pretty sure they are cyber here in this hotel, we have this interview. In the future, it will be literally everywhere. And uh, right now, they are designed on a non-secure platform, uh, and they're vulnerable. I think, speaking about their uh, future, uh, they will be made on their new platforms with a new architecture, and they will be much more safe, immune by design. This is a very interesting concept, immune by design. So, could
could you tell us something? Uh, you, if you want, you can repeat my questions in your answer. Yeah. Okay. So, uh, could you tell us uh, uh, something about? Uh, Excuse me. Let's just. We need to restart okay. uh, the camera. Okay.